16, 12.37. Hey y'all, Artist Poet Girl here, also known as APG Jamie, and today we're going to do away with my old phone, cell phone case. Not that I toss it or anything, I'm keeping it because, you know, because I'm a keeper, okay? Treasure, it's treasure. So first we're going to make a template to fit into our new um, crystal clear case. Which is also by Otterbox. Otter box. You otter have an otter box. <laughs> so anyway, uh, this was instigated or inspired by, excuse me, inspired by Shell, who I will put a link in the upper right hand corner i card it'll be a letter i and it will also be a link in the description box below the video which coinkadinkly will have a list of ingredients okay okay so as you can see i'm trying it on for size and drawing around there and you know stuff like that and mm-hmm I don't know why I keep putting it in and out of the box because I do stuff like that. I'm just using cardstock to make my template with. And uh, if you choose to do this, you can make your template out of whatever you want to make it out of. Now, definitely remember to cut away the pencil line. And in this case, I should have cut away at least two pencil line widths. That's just a, a little emery board in case you need to sand off little edges, which I really didn't. So, anyway, now we're going to decorate a full sheet of uh, 10 and a half by 11 uh, white cardstock. Just the regular, what is it, 110 cardstock from the Gittin store. Mm -hmm, nothing too heavy, and I'm using some oxide inks. Man, I really like those. <laughs> I'm just saying. I don't remember what color. Probably Roken China, probably. Ingredients in the description box below. Hey, can y'all? <laughs> so, anyway, I did not clean off my mat. I left the uh, dried blue there. Because, you know, it got dry with hey, can y'all? And there's a lot of heat gun in this one, just so fair warning. And that was the cracked pistachio heat gun, y'all. And now I'm going to use some worn lipstick, uh, AKA pink. <laughs> and I'm mostly putting it around the edge and then I go for some in the middle. I also wanted just a little bit more, so I put a little bit more, layered it on there. That's one of the good things about this, uh, these um, Distress Oxides, you can layer them. Can you tell us just a little bit more? Just all, uh, just a little bit. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Now I'm going for that wilted violet, because who doesn't love purple? Ah, I love purple. It's purple, but not purple. <laughs> and that there is a crafters, the crafters workshop stencil. I can't remember the name of it. And I'm trying out that sap green uh, archival ink. And you really, it's just really not showing up so good. You can sort of see it, but I want to more see it. I want to more see it. So I switched over to the olive. Okay, olive. And, uh, yep, just putting a little stencilage on there. I'm keeping it pretty simple. Uh, you can also take some of your favorite uh, other art, your other favorite art, and uh, scan it, photograph it, you know, print it out, have it printed out, and uh, use that for your phone case as well. As you can see, I went all over in multi-directions because I plan on using, uh, cutting out my uh, my phone case art directly from this sheet of cardstock and taking the remaining pieces and cutting them into ATC size, which you will see in the video later on. Pretty sure, probably. Okay, because I've not finished, I've not. I'm, I'm going to splatter some gold because I thought gold would be really good. And you know, <laughs> gold dots everywhere. One of these days, I'm going to learn to make a little splatter box, you know, that I keep down there on the floor with the other things, my other treasures, so that I can pull it up there on my desk so I can splatter in it. 
one day when I grow up I might do that and I'm gonna try to show you the gold splatter dots and uh, I can't see them not on the screen you can see them in real life but there you got to twist the paper around and I, and there will be a there there will be a photo montage at the end not yet it's not yet. it's not the end yet you got like five more minutes or so or less more or less probably less and uh, so anyway because I'm cutting out for the ATCs now that will be in a video in another I don't know week okay um, there's my template and I marked which one was the inside which one was the outside because I want to be more confused trying to trying to see what I yeah yeah I want to do it that way so now the outside uh, was fit pretty well is that inside there that little thing I just drawed it around drawed it um, I end up having to trim that up twice more even though I did cut the line off because you do want to cut the line off because you know that that pencil line you know that that's a good eighth of an inch you may not realize it but it is okay I'm keeping them little scraps I don't know why but I, I am so now we're gonna cut that this is our first cut around it I trim it up and I trim it up and I think I trimmed it up a little bit more off screen probably maybe I don't remember okay I think the next one I do I'm gonna make it real bright be like look at me mm-hmm ice phone belongs to APG look at me <laughs> hey it rhymed a little sort of almost can trim that bottom just a little bit they can make it just a little bit more straighter doesn't have to fit perfectly because it the you know I did get the case that has the the black around it yeah you know, it's kind of like a frame y'all this thing of this frame and here I am trimming it up and I think I did trim it up one more time after this I don't think I showed you now I'm trying out my stamp this is that stamp I thunk a, a couple a few months ago or whenever it was and I decided I'd put that on there and I liked it, it so stamping it on there for reals like I said you can copy and or scan and otherwise print uh, your favorite arts and uh, you know template it out I was just going over some of the lines that the ink didn't uh, get to go oh, he can y'all because of the gold splatter dots and then I realized after I heat gunned it to dry it that it, the ink just didn't go over them gold dots so well so I went over a little bit more and I'm cleaning it real the cleaning it real good on the inside it really didn't matter because you really wouldn't have been out yeah you yeah you didn't have to clean it that good Tucking that in. You're gonna get to see me fumble with my phone, sticking it in there in a minute. It's kind of hard to get in there. Just saying. I like it though. This is slimmer than my other case because my other case is an otter box. As you can see, it has a rubber thing on the outside and it's got this plastic thing on the inside. And it makes the phone pretty near twice as thick as it really is. Oh, turn just turn it off. <sighs> it meant I needed to put a you know glass screen protector thingy on there and that came out pretty good I don't show you doing that part but anyway wiping it off wiping it off picking it off probably a dog hair ta-da look it can you see it makes me happy I like it photo montage there you can see the little gold dots now real gold real gold well real enough anyway and here comes the phone I took a picture of out there on the sweet tater vines. They don't really make sweet potatoes, but they sure are pretty green. So anyway, that wraps it up. Thanks for watching. And happy arting, y'all.